Nine big stops on the express train through the association. This is your daily zap. We get started in New Jersey. The Nets have won four games in a row. Tough to stop Pete Pierce going to the hole, but you don't have to stop him. He doesn't do it every play because Darren Williams, well, he's got a response. Knocks down the three-pointer. He missed two games because he was in Dallas with his wife. They had their fourth child. Congratulations to them. And the Nets have won five games in a row. OKC in our nation's capital, Kevin Durant, putting his stamp on the visit. alley you throw down there for Durant. He and the Thunder are on a roll. They win this one 116-89. to The Heat on March 4th lost by 30 to San Antonio. A little redemption tonight. D-Wade to LeBron James. It's a 60-point turnaround. I'll say it again. A 60-point turnaround. Miami takes down San Antonio by 30. Down in South Beach, they're partying. Your final score, 110 to 80. Chris Bosh, the big star in this game. The Memphis Grizzlies have lost two in a row coming in. They're taking on the LA Clippers, and they've got a guy named Zach Randolph. And sometimes you got to lean heavily on Zebo because he can carry you. 30 points and 12 boards for the Grizzlies. Beat the Clippers 105-82. to Denver in New Orleans. Ty Lawson, Raymond Felton. The Denver Nuggets shooting threes everywhere. They win it by 11, 114 to 103. The Houston Rockets and Phoenix Suns trying to make up ground, trying to get that eighth slot in the Western Conference playoffs. Jared Dudley, a chance to win at the buzzer. His three-pointer is offline, and Houston hangs on by a pair. They take it 95-93. Utah hosting the Philadelphia 76ers. This game goes into overtime, and look at Andre Kirilenko climbing up and over Andre Iguodala. That's a little unfair, though. He's got some long arms. There's Al Jefferson. He had a huge game. He paced the Utah Jazz. Utah takes down Philly in overtime, 112 to 107. Sacramento's lost two games this year to Golden State, both games in overtime. Marcus Thornton, though, career high. 42 points. Don't forget about Samuel D'Alembert. Also, he had a career-high 27. The Kings get the win. And the Lakers hosting the Orlando Magic. You know the stars. Kobe Bryant, Pau Gasol, both of them doing their thing. The Lakers win it by 13. Final score 97-84, and that's your Daily Zone.